beginning like I was very optimistic about things because no university I finally got a new phone I was now it gives me that opportunity to create content that I've been wanting to create and of course now everything's gonna seem fine then there's the fact that um, I actually had to also step up in the house had to help with cooking cleaning had to help with my brother because he's homeschooling and stuff so that was like my life because there was you no know, university no cheerleading and it was fine I thought I was very optimistic because I was like, I now have time to do things and things like that. Um, but once university like started, okay, this is gonna have what's gonna happen now. I was able to say, okay, break from social media. Let me do this. Let me do that. But that doesn't always work out, does it? Things really got hit. I can't tell. I can't give a precise thing of when things got hectic because lockdown. And in life, there's going to be ups and downs, so that's really what was happening. Yeah, somehow, university work piled up. And not only that, I got into a relationship and that's also something that I had to try and balance and I was also trying to balance making dance videos people were requesting videos and I was I was my game my Instagram ratings was increasing because of my consistency and my quality unfortunately that's what all users of social media look for and I took my social media breaks here and there, but there were so many times where I was so overwhelmed because I was telling myself, no, this doesn't look right, or I'm not wearing the right clothes, I, oh my word, I can't get the move right, oh my word, my creativity, I'm having a great creativity block. And it seemed like, like I said, it's at different points in time, it wasn't like a just a phase of lock of in in lockdown it literally was like here and there i would feel overwhelmed and get totally demotivated to keep going but my motivation was always everyone keeps supporting me and i just like I can't get enough of it, but then I think to myself, oh my word, there's, no, there's no, not enough support because I don't see people pushing my content as much. I'm just trying to address this. Ah. My laptop died. But I had an epiphany. That's what it is. I told myself, it, I'm, I'm seeking too much satisfaction from the outside whereas my passion lies with me my life is up to me in a sense to an extent I can say no I want to keep doing this regardless of what the feedback is because this is something I love to do making videos making dance videos dancing is something i love to do i want to share that with them with the world but it's up to them if they want to take it or not at least i know i'm sharing but then i think to myself yeah 
if I want to keep dancing, I'll keep doing it. And that's actually what really picked me up. And I'm glad because for the last couple of months, I've really been feeling, no, Chrissy, don't do that to yourself. Keep doing, keep pushing. It's up to you. Nothing's gonna get handed to me. If I want to work for a famous artist, I need to push my content because that's the only way people will share my stuff and they will see my stuff. So lockdown has, has opened my eyes to really just be independent of my goals and my dreams. I, I am with God's will with God's grace, God mercy. I'm very religious. I literally would pray and just like, God, give me strength. I know if I give up, I don't know what I'll do with myself. And having that strength, it just gives me more strength to keep going. So right now, I'm actually feeling so much better. Unfortunately, I also got out of this relationship that I spoke about earlier and I'm actually living my best life. I'm having fun being by myself and learning what I would like in the future, how I would my how I would want my future to be, God willing. And yes, yeah, so this is I'm I'm feeling good because I'm I'm motivated and I'm glad that I had this epiphany because now I'm just motivated to say, I don't care what anybody else thinks, I'm going to keep dancing and I'm going to keep creating. So, lockdown really, really has put things into perspective for me, where I want to be in the future. And I'm so excited that I've pushed myself to be independent and push myself. So I'm proud of myself. Um, unfortunately, it's sad that this is the circumstances I had to learn it. Okay, that was bad English. But I think it was needed. I think everybody also has found ways and things that they didn't know about to help them to help them get rid of some things in their life. But if this, yeah, I'm excited. I don't know how to end this off, but lockdown has been okay. Unfortunately, this is a pandemic, so we're just gonna keep on going because unfortunately, I don't think us as humans can ever stop. Yeah, <laughs> so that's 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 me, that's me during lockdown. It's been a trip.